Y'all got me. Y'all got me. It's JD for the W back again. You see it. You see it. I'm a diehard. I'm here where we win or we lose. Atlanta Dream, we lost a close one to the Minnesota Lynx. Yes, they still have a losing record, even though they beat us. Nafisa Collier, shout out to Nafisa Collier. You know what I'm saying? Crystal Dangerfield and them. They, they did a great job. They did a great job. They did a great job. You know what I'm saying? Uh, 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 Claire, uh, Alicia Clarendon, she tore us up too. Kayla McBride, she had 17 points. Five of nine from the three-point line. I don't know why we allowed her to shoot. Oh, that's, 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 that's what she do. That's what she be doing is shooting threes. That's what she be doing. Shooting threes. You know what? Let me. We lost. We lost. But that's okay. We four and three. We got a winning record. We going places. Now, y'all lucky that Kennedy Carter hurt. Y'all lucky. But it's still all about the dream team. The Atlanta dream. It's JD for the W. Um, we're doing just a little live halftime analysis. There's also another game on the docket. Uh, this evening, uh, we have the Dallas Wings. Uh, versus the Seattle Storm. Seattle's up 57-54 at the half. Just got to halftime. Um, Brianna Stewart's doing her thing in this game. She's getting whatever shot that she wants. Um, Dallas, Enrique Gumbawale, pull-up jumper is crazy. It, we don't really see a lot of WNBA players with pull-up jumpers like that. Like, it's comparable almost to Steph Curry's jumper as far as the quickness of the way that it comes out. Her jump was crazy like that. But I, I want to give, you know what I'm saying, the Minnesota Lynx, give y'all y'all props, y'all got us. Hey, any given night, any given game, WNBA is the professionals, only 144 players. It's a lot of players that should be in the WNBA that ain't. So um, we're going to keep looking at it. I'm sorry I didn't get to do any pregame or uh in-game analysis um, of the Atlanta Dream versus, uh, you know, the Minnesota Lynx. I mean, they ain't even got mine more than they tore us up, man. But that's all right. I'll take my, I'll take my lumps. I'm going to take my lumps. Look, it's JD for the W. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Um, I'm open to do collabs with other podcasters or people who have shows. Uh, follow me on Twitter at JD for the W1. Um, and we will get into tomorrow. We'll have a whole slate of games. So, I'll be talking to you guys then. I'll try to do some uh, pre or in-game analysis, and we will go from there. So, for JD for the W, I appreciate you guys looking in. This is the post-game analysis for the Atlanta Dream. Um, uh, and, uh, the Minnesota Lynx, the Dream fell uh, 86-84. And right now we're at halftime with Seattle Storm and the Dallas Wings. Of course, Seattle's up 57-54 at the half right now. WNBA League pass. Of course, the game with Seattle uh, and Dallas uh, is on Amazon Prime, so they have a deal. The WNBA has a league, uh, a deal with uh, Amazon Prime, so you can watch the game there on Amazon Video. Um, so that game is on there. It's not on cable TV. If you have Amazon Prime, that is where you can catch the video. So I appreciate you guys, uh, and I will catch you guys tomorrow for tomorrow's slate of games.